is up YouTube uh, coming to you today with a review on some electronic components here uh, for I'm using these for FPV as you can see from the Pololu sticker uh, they do robotics and electronics uh, pololu.com check them out these guys are awesome um, they're operating a really great company for one doing a lot for uh, robotics and electronics um, and they have some awesome products especially for FPV drone stuff or again like I said anything to do with uh, you know electronics and robotics like they say um, so I was originally uh, looking at this guy right here uh, kind of show that to you and this is the 5 volt 1 amp step down regulator and this is great for um, filtering some FPV cameras or um, it's a great step down uh, voltage regulator uh, for running all of your uh, your flight controller, cameras, receivers, anything that needs a step down from that uh, 12 volt to 5 volt or you know 14 volt to uh, 5 volt, whatever you need. And while these are great for um, FPV sized LiPo batteries, these can, things can actually take up to um, tw uh, 36 volts. So um, 36 to 5, and that's uh, you know really awesome electronics, especially for us small. It's just a few hundred millivolts above um, 5 volts or, or above under is that's the range uh, so these are great uh, for keeping electronics safe so you don't fry any flight controllers or other electronics um, and so you can have uh, some clean videos what I'm using it for uh, so you don't have that a uh, huge jump in um, voltage uh, causing some static you can keep that straight at 5 volts uh, which is really great for um, making sure your video is clear and your electronics don't fly fry you want your electronics to fly, not fry. You can see here you got the Polu uh, sticker here. And that, uh, again, check them out, polu.com. So let's open these things up. We can take a little bit of a closer look. Uh, so you see here a really, really small package. Uh, you can see here's the pins um, and kind of some relation to the size of my hand. But these things are really small. Um, really tiny. For some reference, here is a normal sized SD card um, and here is a uh, micro SD card there. So you can see just about the size of a micro SD card which is amazing especially uh, for saving weight while you're flying. Uh, this comes with sets of bent pins and straight pins which is great um, and they have your uh, your standard 0.1 inch spacing so they can be used with breadboards really really small really awesome um, and this is I mean again just it's awesome for um, filtering out your voltage uh, for video or for your electronics on anything I mean this thing goes down again uh, to 5 volts which is great uh, for keeping your electronics safe you can see uh, it's really quality made uh, circuit board here printed circuit board is nice uh, nice and clean so you can see you have your uh, voltage out, your ground, your voltage in, your shutdown, and your power good. Um, shutdown and power good are less commonly. It uh, drives low when the output is 120% uh, or 80% of what uh, you're aiming to be, which is uh, obviously 5 volts. And then shutdown, this will uh, trigger um, when it, if you know something goes wrong and the voltage is too high, too low. Um, but if you want uh, it to just remain uh, running, no matter what, uh, which is probably fine for FPV purposes, uh, this sh shutdown can just be left um, untouched. Uh, Ready-made RC also has this uh, voltage in and shutdown uh, soldered together or wired together, um, which could trigger a, a shutdown if the voltage gets above what you need, uh, but I would recommend just voltage in, ground voltage out, uh, like you do. Uh, and to ground the voltage out, you can just run two wires. Uh, one in from the voltage in and then another one out obviously because uh, that's the ground pin. Now the 5 volt 2.5 amp step down uh, is a little bigger. Now by a little bigger um, again and just for reference this is the size of an SD card uh, next to it here and this is the size of a micro SD card uh, so again just a little bit bigger than a micro SD card really nice package and again comes with uh, bent and straight pins as you can see right there um, so this is a really nice board again really nicely soldered a little bit bigger obviously because of the uh, more amps going through it uh, this is a 
5 volt 2.5 amp uh, voltage regulator. Uh, so if you do have an electronic that needs 5 volts but needs a little more juice to it, uh, which exists, there are some things out there that need it, this uh, is definitely going to be what you need, um, especially because of the small size, uh, nicely made package. And it has got the uh, same connections. You see, you got a ground over here, uh, you're out in and power good over here, uh, all the connections you need over there. Uh, so this is really uh, another nice package, especially if you got something that needs less voltage but a little more uh, power going to it, some more amps. Um, that's what you are going to need to use. Uh, so thanks for watching this review. Again, the uses for these are going to be FPV uh, camera voltage um, filtering. Uh, or any other electronic that's run straight off your battery that needs 5 volts, which is common. Um, that's, uh, for those of you that don't know, also the voltage that would come um, off of a battery eliminator circuit on a ESC is the 5 volts. Uh, so if you aren't running BEC, BEC uh, these are going to be uh, the things you are going to need. Uh, so go ahead and look these guys up. Uh, Polu.com. These guys have all the hookups. You, you'll also find these um, on uh, electronics on Get FPV, uh, but I always like to go to the source personally and not use resellers. So uh, if you do want some quality uh, voltage regulating products for your next RC robotics or FPV project, uh, polu.com, P O L O L U.com, uh, pick these guys up. Uh, you got some nice pins, or you can solder straight to these uh, holes here. Super lightweight, especially for micro frames, which people might be starting to make here uh, as winter approaches. So thanks for watching this video. Again, check these guys out. Uh, they uh, are a great company for robotics and also sell their parts through GitFPV. Uh, but like I said, I like to go straight to the source. Uh, these guys are great. Um, shipping is very inexpensive because uh, they ship uh, from on-site. So again, check these out. And uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to check out my other videos. I'm going to be doing a line of some FPV reviews coming up here uh, shortly. So if you are interested in FPV, how to make an FPV, all the components that go into it, uh, this is just scratching the surface. This is just a start, one small component. And while, mouse, while it may seem daunting, uh, there are a lot of resources out there, and I'm very willing to help you guys. If you are interested in some other drone videos, uh, check out the link below um, in the description uh, for some other videos um, on drones. And stay tuned for some more electronic and uh, FPV drone videos to come. Thanks for watching.